how you going just doing a quick video on the modifications i'm doing on my forging press if you know some of you might know that i've converted a 12 ton log splitter and the controls used to be up the top and the old motor was attached to this bit after 12 months of use the old motor finally packed it in so i had to replace it and i ordered a power pack unit from a company called hydraulic online they're based up in the gold coast so it's a full unit the motor pump and a tank today i i have been using it with the lever controls but i've received a package the other day so today i've removed the hoses from the hydraulics the lever and connected them up straight through because now it'll be running through the solenoids and I've got electric foot controls to install and they're wired it up for me so it's just plug in and play and this will be this will control everything so I'll be able to get away with removing the power source from the top because the actual motor will be connected to there and the off and on switch will be on the side which i'll be mounting up underneath my double adapter board up the top so it'll be electric foot controls if ready for the test connected the box up onto the wall had to swap out the solenoids when i really originally ordered online from hydraulic a company called hydraulic online on the Gold Coast, I ordered for a 240 volt, but after talking to them, they told me I needed a 12 volt for the foot control, so they supplied me with the new ones. Swapped them out, everything's plugged up, so I'm about to plug it in and give it a test. And my switch is there on the side now, instead of being up on the top, it's all over here. I'll tidy up all these wires once I've finished and got it going. It's running. And now just to test out the controls. And it's working. Works good. Now I'll be able to get a chair. I'll be able to sit down at the right height and work my steel. And be able to use back hands to get the control and everything. Here I'm just setting my, my first welds on a Damascus billets. First time using the foot control supplied by Hydraulic Online up in the Gold Coast. Makes it a lot easier for me. I can sit down and look at the billet and use both hands to control it. Blokes up there uh, at, at uh, Hydraulic Online are really, really helpful. Rang them up, told them what I needed. They got everything set up for me, so just when I received it, I just had to plug it all in. Done no changes to it, and it works really well. Big thanks to the boys up there, and um, I hope a lot of people get some inspiration from this. Try and work out something. Convert this is a, a lock splitter that I converted over, and it makes the job a lot easier for me. I'm trying to do it all by hand. Thank you.